two Western Kung Fu students, Michael from France and Ching Yuan from Denmark, talk about their experiences of learning Kung Fu at this school and what it means for them. The school is in Deng Feng, Henan Province, China. Dhammo is the Chinese name of Bodhidharma, who gave Zen to the world after meditating in the mountains you can see behind the two students. Chan is the Chinese word for Zen. Wushu is the gymnastic type of Kung Fu, taught in most of the Kung Fu schools in Deng Feng, including the Shaolin Temple, where Michael initially studied. Note that Michael uses a very French pronunciation of kids and foreigners. When I arrived at this place, it, it almost seemed like, it didn't seem like I had found the right place. It just seemed like I returned to home. It, it, it was almost like I, uh, I just returned to my family. It was like I had just been gone for a very long time. Uh, my first experience in China, uh, I came here to see uh, the Damos Cave, actually. And uh, I was really interested in practicing martial arts uh, in Shaolin Temple. So first I, I asked uh, some people to get into a school. And uh, that's the beginning of my journey in China. Uh, in the Wushu school. So after three years of practicing, uh, coming back in China for to practice uh, in in the in those school, I felt a bit disappointed because of the treatment of the the kids. Uh, this is really hard for me. Uh, right now I have 32 years old, so. Uh, wushu is like more gymnastic. Uh, then I realized I need to find something else, uh, the real Kung Fu. Yes, in Denmark I trained uh, an internal system called Lan Shu. It is a bit similar to this. Uh, I do, however, find this a bit more... Um, it just uh, it fits together very nicely and it, it, everything is very uh, very flowing and, and uh, makes more sense to me. So on internet uh, I found pictures of Master Wunan Fong performing and talking about Chan Buddhism. I was really amazed by his performance so I decided to go uh, to see that that's cool. Actually I was really lucky uh, I came in Dangfang uh, this morning and I met those foreigners uh, practicing in, in w Master Wunanfang school. So they gave me uh, the card to go there. And uh, after one day, I went to, to see the master and asked him to be a student. And that makes a real difference between uh, the Wushu and the Kung Fu. Uh, I feel so much better to studying uh, that style. Uh. Um, I sort of get a set. Uh, it, it feels very natural. It feels correct. Um, the uh, the Wugulun uh, Kung Fu defines the way I move, the way I talk, the way I think, even the way I eat, and it's very very important to me. Uh, it is how I live and how I how I am. Mm. It defines my personality. Mostly, the difference between wushu and kung fu is uh, wushu is more like gymnastic. Uh, kung fu is uh, teaching how to live, how to move. Uh, we have Chan Buddhism uh, inside uh, the teachings, uh, which is different uh, from the Wushu schools. Uh, Wushu is only about performing uh, and the kids are treated like not really good. Uh, it's really hard for foreigners to, to be in a Wushu school at Shaolin Temple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you mean uh, it's like uh, for everyday daily life uh, yeah, yeah, you can use exactly. this Kung Fu. Uh, 
that's what I, I, I try to make well. everything yeah. kung fu. Mm. Yeah, that's that's the big difference. It's not only about performance. It's it's the way to to live. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's a way of life. Yeah, way of life. Yeah. It really is. Uh -huh. Yeah. So uh, I think that's why we came in that school uh, to find something more uh, than just moving, just martial arts. Uh, there's something more spiritual yeah. uh, in this Kung Fu. And also we were looking for a sort of a family community. Yeah, yeah, true. Uh, we eat, we sleep, we train together. Mm -hmm. And, and we all build happens the school in this one together. little place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so true. <laughs> we make our own family. Uh, foreigners and Chinese are members of the same family. It's really important. That, that makes a real difference between the other school, maybe commercial, commercial school, so... Mm. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> well, it, it, it is very different from many other schools. Um, Master and his wife uh, and his children, they, we all live in, in the same school. It's not like uh, I, I can imagine in other schools, the. Um, the teacher, the coach, is they would just w go home af after that. They consider it work. Uh, for the Wu family, it is just their life. It's what they do every day. Mm. Yeah, I remember the, the picture I, I show you about these two foreigners. Um, they were from Italy, actually, uh, you remember? And the yeah. master uh, came um, because they were leaving that day. And uh, he took their hands, and we 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 make we made picture of them, and this the first time I I, I saw something like this in China, uh, a great masters just hand to hand with the foreigners, and uh, th that was a very special day. Um, love from this family, I think that's that's the most important. I I, I noticed that it's really amazing. Thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you, you won't find that in, in uh, other many schools. schools. Yeah, yeah, yeah.